Well, howdy ho, good neighbor. Today, we're flying high above Alameda Naval Base. That's right. The old Naval Base has been catching on fire. The homeless have finally moved in. That's right, they're living here in the old Naval Base. And... I was fortunate enough or unfortunate enough to watch the Alameda Fire Department put out a fire here the other day. So I charged up the drone and was going to go take a little look and see what kind of damage they did. So you can see I just flew over an old fire. And here was the fire that happened the other day. I took this photo, or excuse me, video the day after. And I talked to some people and they said that the homeless have been living right here in these buildings. You can see that the doors are open. And as I back off here that's where the fire was yesterday and you could see there's all kinds of furniture that the fire department threw out so I thought that the roof would be more damaged but no nope. and while I was there the fire department was breaking out all the windows to get air into the building so that's not hoodlums breaking out the windows that was the fire department so each time there's a fire here, that's just one stage closer of this place getting burned down and taken down. You could see there's some people walking down there, and I didn't realize you could walk among those buildings. But yes, there is a fence there, so it makes sense you can walk through there. But I did see some kids inside the building and that's what I was looking for here. You look at there's a chair up there. And I did see kids up on the second level. But they might have heard my drone and was hiding. That's just speculation. But if you hear a drone, you might think it's security. Not knowing it's just me. So I didn't spot those kids. So, but I did come back over here to take one little look at what the damage of that fire did. And you can see that there are plenty of other buildings to still catch fire here. I will say this, you can tell that there's a lot of spray paint it has been wasted on the tops of these roofs. So if you think you're alone here, you're not. These people set up a full house. Look at that furniture. There's. I wish I would have took a little more time to zoom in on that furniture. But like I was saying, they waste a lot of spray paint up here. And some of this art is, well, it is art. And some of it's just scribbling. You can't read it. But you can see that the wind was blowing pretty good here. And that was a fire that they had just the other day. So somebody has been starting fires here. And you can see on the bottom level there, there is a mattress and other living items. So people have a mattress and like couches and lamps. So if you don't think anybody's living in there, you would be wrong. And you can't really blame them, can you? It's a tent or a whole floor to yourself. Pick a floor 
And there's a restroom right across the street, a brand new bathroom they just built for the skate park and the gymnasium. So you can see with the plants growing on the roof, this place has definitely seen better days. I wonder how long it'll stay with the fires being started. So this is a good little documentary of these buildings before they come down. Or maybe the fire department will just keep coming out here. One day they might just let it all burn. I don't know. You never know what to think when the city is involved with something that they're not making money on and that's just costing them money. And the Alameda Naval Base, well, it sure is costing them money. There's not a lot of money to be had out here. But here is the entrance, the north entrance to the Alameda Naval Base. And if you've served time here, well, you know exactly where I'm at. But the residents here have changed a little. I don't think you remember this greeting you at the front gate of the Alameda Naval Base. So these people might have moved in to one of those floors. I think I would. I'd rather have a whole floor with a roof than one of those tarps and a makeshift tent. Well, that's what greets you at the north entrance at the old jet. Well, one last look at these beautiful buildings that probably won't be here very long as I view that beautiful city of San Francisco and the Bay Bridge in the background. So much wasted land and so much potential out here on the Alameda Naval Base. Well, before I end this video, I always want to thank you for coming along with me. But before I do, I want to show you the Alameda City View Skate Park. Yeah, that's my old stomping grounds when I was younger. I used to ride that skateboard all around that park. And while I was here filming, I ran into one of my old skateboard buddies, the mayor of City View Skate Park. That's right, the mayor himself. I said, hey mayor, can I see a skateboard? He said, sure, follow me. So if you ever recognize the mayor of the City View Skate Park, that's him. One of the nicest guys in all of Alameda. Jojo. Well, I tried to get him a little closer, but I was under these trees showing off, and I did not want to crash my drone in front of the mayor. That would not be good. So, you see how easy he just climbs right up those curbs. He just jumps them up. So, when all these skateboarders get done with their skateboarding shoes they come over here to this light pole and they throw their shoes up on the light pole and let them hang and every once in a while the city has to come and tear them down well there's the mayor doing one last trick for you yeah he's getting old just like the rest of us but he could still got it. Bye bye, Mayor. 
Well, as always, I want to thank you again for coming along with me on these Alameda Naval Base Fire Adventures. Yeah, who knows long how long those buildings will be there. You know the drill. Peace, love, and all that hippie jazz.